ballerina. And today, I'm listening to Ms Mimi. But I'm thinking about lunch. And we'll finish this lesson after we take our break. I want to sit next to Ms Mimi. I want to sit wherever there's a plate full of cheese. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I'm not even going to take my tap shoes off. Me neither. Let's go. Hello? Hmm. Huh? Story. I wasn't afraid. Ghost stories don't scare me. But sometimes these stories can be true. Mm. What if there is a ghost in Rockfall Hall? Oh, I wouldn't like that. Me neither. What about you, AJ? You're really truly brave. You aren't afraid, are you? Who, me? Afraid? <laughs> I'm from New Cheese City. I'm never afraid. Don't worry, girls. AJ, ghost catching mouse is in the house. Oh no, we can't be ghost catchers. It's too scary. All right, if you're so afraid, we can tell Ms Mimi about it over lunch. Or we could introduce ourselves and try to be this ghost friend. Be the ghost's friend? Oh, no, no, no! There is no way I will make friends with the ghost! I'm afraid! Me too! Me too? But AJ isn't. He can lead the way! Yes, um, that's right! I said I wasn't afraid and so, um, I'm not! I'll just go right in there! Shake that ghost's hand and say, hello, ghost. Yes, that's what I'll do. <gasps> Ready or not, here we come. <sighs> OK, so far so good. Who's with me? We are. Mr. 
Mr. Ghost, are you there? You try. Uh, hi there, Mr. Ghost. Nice weather we're having, isn't it? I think the ghost is gone. Time for lunch. Maybe Gracie should try too. Gracie? Gracie? Where are you? Gracie? Gracie? It's me. It's me. Oh. I don't want to talk to this ghost. If we meet him, maybe he won't seem so scary. Oh. Hello, ghost. <gasps> well, Vicky was wrong. We met this ghost and he is scary. <gasps> Wait a minute. This ghost has rhythm. What? That ghost went tappity tap tap. Like this. Wait, aren't you afraid of the ghost? Nothing with rhythm this good could ever be scary. This ghost is the best. He's got amazing rhythm, just like me. Mm -hmm. Hip-hop is all about doing what the other guy can do and then doing something more. Tap dancers do that too. Watch this. Here's what the ghost sounded like. And then AJ added a rhythm that sounded like this. And this is all me. It's my turn to dance with a ghost. Everybody knows I am the best tap dancer. dancing with a ghost. And aren't you afraid of ghosts? Mm -mm, not anymore. Now that I've met this ghost, he's got to be my friend. My good friend. He's my friend too, but can you do this? Yes, I can. No one can do it like this. What about this? <gasps> Bye, ghost! Oh! We're coming! Maybe we were right all along about ghosts being scary because this one really scared us. What's wrong? Ghost was mad. 
Because when dancers try to outdo each other, it's a great thing. It's a way for your friends to challenge you to be better. So the ghost was just being a good friend. I knew that. I knew he wasn't scary. Yes, I did. The only reason I ran away so fast was because I wanted to tell Miss Mimi. Okay, I was a little afraid of the ghost. <laughs> <laughs> if there is a ghost... Listen. <gasps> wow! Oh. Hey! The ghost is in the grounds! Yes, and so is a family of woodpeckers. They are making their home up in the roof of Camembert Academy. <laughs> I would imagine their tapping would sound very loud inside Rockford Theatre. Gracie, where are you going? I think we should introduce ourselves and become friends. You are so right! Hello! Woodpeckers! It doesn't matter that our new friend turned out to be a woodpecker instead of a ghost. What really counts is he's a good friend. And he's got rhythm! I'm Angelina Ballerina and today is one of my most favourite days of the year, Halloween. My friends and I have ordered our Halloween costumes from a catalogue and they should arrive any minute. <sighs> Still no sign of the UP Mouse delivery van. I'm so frustrated. Oh, I hope our costumes come in time. Of course they will. They have to. Perhaps the van is just running late. Here's a picture of the costume I ordered. Isn't it beautiful? I'm going to be Odette, the enchanted princess turned into a swan from the ballet Swan Lake. <sighs> I just hope all the feathers don't make me sneeze. Hey, I want to see my costume. I'm still looking at mine, Polly. Now, girls, please take turns. That must be the delivery mouse at the door. Oh. Look at my Super Sally costume. It has a cake. Is that someone coming? Oh, go look! It must be the delivery mouse. No. Isn't the UP Mouse van awfully late, Mum? I'll call UP Mouse to see what's going on. I can't wait to try on my robe. I'm going to be Carabos, the wicked fairy in the Sleeping Beauty Ballet. Is she really mean? Don't worry, Polly. It's make-believe. I'm going to be a snowflake from the Nutcracker Ballet. All glittery and sparkling. Oh, oh dear. That's terrible news. Well, are the costumes coming? I'm afraid not. The delivery van had a flat tyre. And the costumes won't arrive until tomorrow. Tomorrow? But Halloween is tonight! And now it's too late to buy or make any more costumes. Yes, and it's almost trick-or-treat time. What are we going to do? I don't think there's anything we can do. Without costumes, our Halloween is ruined. I was really looking forward to being a swan. And I really, really wanted to fly like Super Sally. But I can't fly without my cape. 
I don't think you could fly even with a cape. But you could still play the Super Sally music, and when people open their doors, you could run up to them like this. That would almost seem like flying. I know a ballet step that's even more like flying. The Grand Jeté. See, Polly? It's just like flying. Oh, teach me how to do it. Absolutely, positively. You take a few quick running steps, then you leap up into the air like this. My turn! <laughs> Look! I'm flying like Super Sally! You just gave me an absolutely stupendous idea, Polly. Why don't we all dance our characters for Halloween? Yes, why do we need costumes? I'm sure we can each come up with a dance step. That would be a great way to trick or treat. Hmm, I wonder how a snowflake would dance. I know, in the Nutcracker Ballet, the snowflakes waltz like this. One, two, three. 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 Oh, yes! A waltz has a one, two, three rhythm. One, two, three. One, two, three. I'm as light as a snowflake. <gasps> and I could dance the part of the Wicked Fairy when she gives Sleeping Beauty the spinning wheel to prick her finger. Oh, the Wicked Fairy's very bad. Don't worry, Polly. Remember, it's make-believe. OK, I won't be afraid of Vicky. What about you, Angelina? How are you going to be a swan? Hmm, I can do a gliding step like a glissade. like a swan, Angelina. See? With the right dance steps, we can dance our characters when we trick or treat. But our neighbours will notice we're not wearing costumes. Yes, will they still give us treats? Uh-oh. I think our dancing will be just as good as wearing costumes. But just in case, maybe we could find some little props and things to go with our characters. We could look in Mum's arts and crafts box. Good idea, Polly. Ooh! Look at all this great stuff. Look, I have some masks. Do you have a spinning wheel for the Wicked Fairy? No, but I might have some fairy dust. This could be a swan feather. And these are sparkly like snowflakes. Hmm, stupendous, Mum. I hope you're not feeling too upset about the costumes. We're okay. With our dance steps and these props, our neighbours should have no trouble guessing who we are for Halloween. I know. Let's try our trick-or-treat dances on your dad. Great idea. Well, well, well. Who do we have here? Guess who, Daddy? Whoa! Hmm. I'm not sure. <laughs> Wait, I know. It's Super Sally herself. Flying in to save the day. Hee-hee! <laughs> This would work. And who else is with you, Super Sally? Ooh, 
Is it just me or is it getting cold out? I could swear there's a touch of snow in the air. <laughs> Maybe the neighbours will give us treats after all. Trick or treat! Oh, goodness me! A wicked fairy! If I give you and your friends a cheesy treat, I hope you won't cast a spell on me. <laughs> She's not really a wicked fairy, Mrs Thimble. She's just pretend. Oh, thank goodness. Looks like we don't need fancy costumes from a catalogue. We can express ourselves with music and dance And we can tell a story without using words We can tell a story that nobody's heard Sometimes it's hard to say the things we want to And here's another see a wicked fairy, a snowflake, and who's this? Oh, why it's Odette from Swan Lake. Such a graceful swan. Achoo! Thanks, Miss Mimi. In fact, you mouselings have given me a wonderful idea. Did you know that the same composer wrote music for all three of the ballets you chose? Really? Who? His name was Tchaikovsky, and he wrote the music for Sleeping Beauty, The Nutcracker and Swan Lake. Tchaikovsky was so amazing! So, what's your idea, Miss Mimi? I'm thinking that for our next recital, you can do some dances from Swan Lake, Sleeping Beauty and the Nutcracker. Oh, that's a great idea! <laughs> yes! Did Tchaikovsky write a ballet about Super Sally? <laughs> I'm afraid not, but with grand châtés like that, I'm sure you can have a part too, Polly. I've got five cheesy treats, three brie twirls, and a whisker snap. I'll trade you a cheddar drop for one of your brie twirls. All right. Trick or treating was so amazing. Nobody even noticed we didn't have costumes. They really thought I was Super Sally. Yes, you were flying high. We all were. Who needs costumes when you know how to dance? <laughs> I'm Angelina Ballerina and there's nothing I love more than dancing with my very best friend. You can do all the steps I make up, even the really hard ones. Alice, Alice and, and Angelina, Angelina, friends forever! forever.
partner in the showcase tomorrow. It will be our first time dancing together at your new school. We have to be extra good. I have an idea. What if we end our dance with a twirl? Or a leap? Or a cartwheel? Actually, I've made up all the steps for our dance and a cartwheel is not in it. Oh. Okay. Hi, girls. I came up to have a peek at your new dance. Here's a few of the steps I made up. Nice choreography, Angelina. Choreography? A choreographer creates a dance like an author creates a story. Wow! I love being a choreographer. And I know dancing makes little girls very hungry. Yes, I'm hungry. I've brought you some lovely sandwiches. Now I'm off to check on Polly. Thanks, Thank Mum. Thank you. Poor Polly's in bed. She has the sniffles. My dad says almost everybody in Chipping Cheddar has the sniffles. But we don't. So we, we can, can dance, dance and dance. This will be the best dance with a partner showcase ever because I have the best partner ever. Attention dancers, Marco will be my helper today. Don't forget, all dancers in the dance with a partner showcase must have a partner. Vicky's going to be my partner. Gracie and I are going to do a hip-hop dance, Miss Mimi. I'm dancing ballet with Alice, my absolutely, positively best friend from where I used to live. Wow! Alice is coming to the showcase. Yes. Have you and Alice been practising? Yes, a lot. I did some really fancy choreography for our dance. Well, we didn't plan ours. We make up new moves as we go along. <laughs> Hey, it's fun! <gasps> Stupendous! We just dance with the music. It's called improvising. We use steps we know, but we don't plan the order. <laughs> So our dance is a little bit new and different each time. <laughs> don't you want to improvise too, Angelina? I don't think so. You and your partner did a wonderful job in the showcase, Angelina. Congratulations! <gasps> Thank you, Miss Mimi. Your choreography was brilliant. And thank you, Angelina. We did all the steps just like you said to. And we didn't make any mistakes. Hooray! Angelina! 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 I can't find our music player and we need it for our showcase dance. I have an extra player at my house. I'll lend it to you. Oh, thank you, Angelina. Thank you. Me. You're such a good friend. No problem, Vicky. Hello? Angelina Ballerina speaking. Angelina, it's Alice. I have the sniffles. Isn't that horrible? So I can't be your partner and we can't be in the showcase. I'm so sorry, Alice. I hope you feel better soon. Alice, I'm so sorry. I can't believe my terrible luck. Alice got the sniffles and now I don't have a partner. What am I going to do? <gasps> Angelina! Here's your music player back. Guess what happened? Gracie can't be in the showcase. She has the sniffles. Oh, poor Gracie. Alice has them too. Oh, poor Alice. Well, see you later, then. <gasps> Vicky, wait! What if you and I become partners? <gasps> 
dancing with you is going to be so amazing, Angelina. Come on, I'll teach you all of my steps. OK. And then we'll improvise. Let's try some new steps too. Ballet? No, but it's fun. But you have to do the steps my way, because I'm the choreographer. Well, maybe you should dance all by yourself, Angelina Ballerina. See you later. <gasps> I could be great at the showcase. I know I could. All I need is a partner who can learn my dance. Hmm. Hello. How do you do? I'm so sorry to hear Gracie has the snuffles. Miss Mimi said to tell you that you and your partner are going to dance first in the showcase. Whoa! That's your partner? Yes. But she's not real. Of course she is. She's a real dancing doll. Hmm. The rules don't say no dancing dolls. Good. But they don't say they're okay either. I'm not sure about this, Angelina. Oh. Miss Mimi, I wish I could dance in the showcase. You really want to be in the showcase, don't you? Yes, I really do. And are you willing to work hard? Mm-hmm. Then I'll give you some extra time to come up with a routine. And instead of going first, <gasps> I'll let you and your partner huh? dance last today. My partner? I just know the two of you can work together. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Vicky. No, it was my fault. Why can't we make it work? I don't know. I have an idea. Maybe instead of dancing at the same time, you could take turns. Hmm. Well, it's worth a try. Okay, we're ready. Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> that was a very original and exciting piece, and I loved the choreography. What hard-working and creative mouselings you are! Bravo! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Take a bow, girls. All three of you. Yippee! Hello, I'm Angelina Ballerina. And today, I'm very excited. Gracie's parents are going away for a few days, so she's coming to stay at my house. So remember, whenever you do a pirouette, you must fix your eyes on one thing, like the door. And when you spin around, you look at the door for as long as you can. And then you spin your head around to look again. And that's how you can spin around and around and around without getting dizzy. <laughs> now you try. Oh. oh, this is trickier than it looks. Oh, I'm going to have to do lots of practice. Good mouselings, well done. See you all tomorrow. I couldn't wait for Gracie to get here. I wanted everything to be perfect. There. <gasps> Gracie! I'll get it! Gracie, come in! Let me carry your suitcase. Whoa! Okay. I'll show you where you're sleeping. Hello, Mrs. Mouseling. Hello, Gracie. This is our room. And this is where you're going to sleep. And this is your very own drawer, where you can keep all your things. Thanks, Angelina. Who's that? That's Mousie, my favourite toy. And this is my bedtime book. The Fairy and the Mousemaid. I can't wait to find out if the Mousemaid can rescue the fairy from the dragon. <gasps> Being roommates is going to be lots of fun. Can I show you how to make my special smoothie? Yes. Fun. I'm so glad you came to stay. Good night, Angelina. Good night, Gracie. Good night, music box. Good night, books. Good night, moon. Gracie, who are you talking to? Oh, just things in the room. I like to say good night to everything. Good night, Mousy. Hmm? Good night, window. Good night, door. Gracie, I'm trying to read. Sorry. Good night, pictures. Good night, good night, lamp. <sighs> Gracie, I can still hear you. It's okay. I finished. Time to turn the light off now, girls. See you in the morning. But I didn't get to read The Fairy and the Mousemaid. Never mind, Angelina. You can read it tomorrow. All right. Night. I was beginning to think that sharing a room might not be so much fun after all. What on earth are you doing? Playing the harmonica. And it's trickier than it looks. But why are you doing it so early in the morning? I need to fit in two practices a day. Did you know? You can blow it like you can other instruments, but you can breathe back in and it plays different notes. But 
crazy. I like to get up slowly. And look, I can make it make a wobbly sound if I wiggle my paws back and forth. That's called a vibrato. Oh, and too much noise in the morning makes my ears curl. There. I've got my bag ready for school. I'll get mine ready too. Hmm, that's strange. I thought my English book was here. Here it is, Angelina. I've organised your books by colour. They'll be much easier to find now. Now they're all mixed up. I was only trying to help, Angelina. Angelina! Gracie, breakfast! Great! Come on, Angelina! I'll be down as soon as I find all my school books. First I couldn't read my story, then Gracie woke me up really early, and then I couldn't find my school books so I was late for breakfast. I just hope Gracie doesn't move anything else around. Angelina, let's be pirates together. No, I need to practice my pirouettes now. Oh! Ouch! But now there's not enough room. Why have you moved everything? So it's all laid out just like a pirate ship. Oh, okay. Um... I suppose I can practice in the corner. Right. I'll fix my eyes on the hat stand and spin. Oh! Did you forget to fix your eyes on something, Angelina? No, Gracie, I didn't. I fixed my eyes on the hat stand and you moved it. But I needed a mast for my pirate ship. Well, I can't fix my eyes on something that's moving. Sorry, Angelina Grouchy Mouse. I won't move it again. There is not enough room to do what I need to do. Whenever I spin, I bump into you. There is not enough space, I can't seem to find a place To jump, one, two, and not bump into you Sometimes it isn't easy to find room to dance But if we work together, we just might have a chance I move to the left, I move to the right No matter where I move, it's just too tight No, there is not enough space, no, we can't find the right place to jump or spin, where do we begin? Sometimes it isn't easy to find room to dance But if we work together, we just might have a chance No, sometimes it isn't easy to find room to dance But if we work together, we just might have a chance oh. Gracie, Angelina, time to get ready for bed Great We've got to get ready for bed, and I haven't done any practice. Well, neither have I. Good night, music box. Good night, books. Good night, moon. 
Good night. Not that again. I'm trying to read. But, Angelina, I do it every night. Gracie, I want to find out if the mousemaid rescues a fairy. And you're ruining my reading time. Well, if that's the way you feel, I'll go and sleep somewhere else. I don't know why I bothered. She is such a misery mouse. Ah. Now I have my room to myself. But it does seem awfully quiet. Harmonica music is quite nice. And I really like drawing with Gracie. <sighs> Maybe I haven't been a very good friend. Oh, Mousy. I should have remembered that Gracie is my guest. And she's probably missing her mum and dad. I heard you playing the harmonica. Do you mind if I come in and listen? Of course not, Angelina. I'm sorry I've been such a grouchy mouse. I'm sorry I ruined your reading. Maybe we could read your book together. I've got a better idea. Let's do the pirate dance just once before we go to sleep. <laughs> yes! 